And tonight we're following the money further to see how this new round of funding will create results, if it will. Right, and our Jennifer Dowling spoke with two major players in combating homelessness in the city to check on what can happen next. Jennifer? Well, there are a few things. And number one, Portlanders really want to see an impact from this funding right away. They're tired of the homeless crisis and they want some relief for those folks on the streets. So some of the first big impacts that we could see include new motel rooms coming online to help the homeless. Yeah, enjoy. Feel free to come back around. At the Blanche House, volunteers serve up hot meals to those in need six days a week. The need has really been extraordinary. We're serving about a thousand meals a day. With the arrival of cold weather, volunteers are also handing out boots, socks, and warm clothing along with care packages. So this has some snacks. Scott said he was excited to learn that both the city and county now have budgeted around $19 million each in surplus money towards combating homelessness. The need for some immediate relief is really extraordinary. The suffering that we're seeing is just um, escalating as this pandemic wears on. Some of that relief will come from the addition of hundreds of new shelter beds made possible from the surplus. Yeah, we're looking at a couple motel sites. We're looking at some congregate sites, sites out in Southeast Portland, East County, other parts of downtown, um, just to really sort of bring some depth out to where things are. And it's, it's four or 500 beds. The spokesperson for the Joint Office of Homeless Services, Dennis Theralt, says the new 400 to 500 beds will complement other projects already in the works bumping up the potential total number of newer shelter beds to close to 1,000. If you add the 300 plus beds from the Safe Rest Villages, plus you know the beds that we're gonna keep going permanently uh, from the, the COVID shelters that we've opened, because we've opened several shelters just to maintain shelter capacity over the last year. Um, all of that is gonna be eight, 900 beds. Theralt says new motel rooms could provide the most immediate impact for those now left out in the cold. We're in negotiations with some some property owners already and have been, and I think those could turn over pretty quickly. I'm looking forward to, to seeing some real improvement, hopefully in short order. And trash pickup might be another thing that we notice more quickly when in relation to this surplus budget money. The mayor said just a few days ago that this surplus funding would return trash pickup to pre-pandemic levels. Reporting live in Portland, Jennifer Dowling, Coin6 News. Jennifer, and that's it. More quick results. That's what a lot of people want to see in helping this homeless crisis. Thank you.